Welcome to AminAcademy.com, I mean IB Diploma Mathematics. Let us solve some problem with quadratics. Look at this example. The sum of a number and its reciprocal is 5, 1 over 5. Find the number. Let Let the number equal to x, then reciprocal, it's reciprocal equal 1 over x. The sum those numbers, that is x plus 1 over x, which is equal to 500, 1 over 5. So, x plus 1 over x equal 5 1 over 5 is 5 5 is 25 plus 1 is 26 over 5. Multiply throughout over x. x into x is x square. x into 1 over x is 1. 26 over 5 into x. Then by cross multiplying, y square plus 5 equal 26 over x. That is 5x square minus 26x plus 5 equal 0. It's a quadratic. Now, look at here. 5 into 5 is 25. It is split as minus 25. minus 1. So we have minus 25 into minus 1 is 25. Addition is minus 26. So we have that is 5x square minus 25x minus x plus 5 equal to 0. 5 x take out common x minus 25 minus 1 x here 5 5 into 5 is 25 x minus 5 equals 0 therefore x minus 5 and 5 x minus 1 equal to 0 therefore the number x equal to 5 and x equal to 1 over 5. Since 5x equal to 5x minus 1 equals 0, 5x equal to 1 and x equal to 1 over 5. Therefore, the number, the number equal to 5. That means 5 is the number and 1 over 5 is reciprocal and sum of this one is 5 1 over 5 we got. Next question. The product of two consecutive even integer is 360. Therefore, let find the number. The first even number is x. Second number, second consecutive Second consecutive number is x plus 2. Since x is a even number, x plus 2 is the second consecutive even number. The product of two consecutive even number is even number. The product product is x into x plus 2, which is equal 360. So multiplying that is x into x is x squared plus 2x minus 360 equal to 0. Here, 360, we have to split 360 in terms of middle and pro sum and product, but we can use the quadratic formula x equal to minus b plus or minus root b square 2 square is 4 minus 4ac, 4 
a minus 360 by 2 which is equal minus 2 plus or minus 4 plus minus minus plus 4 zeros are 0 4 6 are 24 2 carries 4 3 are 12 12 plus 2 is 14 4 0 0 4 6 are 24 24 2 carries 4 3 are 12 14 over 2 which is equal minus 2 plus minus root of 1 4 your square root of One four 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 is uh, thirty eight, which is equal minus two plus or minus thirty eight by two, which is equal positive number that is minus two plus thirty eight by two, which is equal thirty six by two is eighteen. Therefore, the numbers are numbers are 18 and even consecutive is 20. So, 20 into 18 is 360, which is given. Next question. The number of diagonals of an n-sided polygon is given by the formula d equal to n by 2 n minus 3. A polygon has 90 diagonals. How many sides does it have? Here n is the number of sides. D is the diagonal. D is n over 2 n minus 3. Here it has diagonals 90 diagonals where n equal to number of sides. So by cross multiplying and equal 19 to 2 is 180. So product n squared minus 3n minus 180 equal 0. Here n equal to minus b. That is minus of minus 3 is 3 plus or minus root b squared is minus 9 whole squared is 9 minus 3 whole squared is 9 minus 4 a is 1 c is minus 190 over 2 which is equal 3 plus or minus square root of 9 4 into 180 minus 4 into minus 180 is 0 4 8s are 32 3 carries 4 ones are 4 7 over 2 which is equal 3 plus or minus square root of 7 729 729 square root of 729 27 so which is equal 3 plus or minus 27 by 2 equal 30 over 2 equal to 15 therefore the number of sides is 15 number of sides of the polygon 15 here look at here if you substitute 15 here that is n into n minus uh, 15 minus 3 is 12 12 here uh, 15 by 2 
that is 90 comes next one the length of your rectangle is 4 centimeter longer than width given that its area is 26 find length and breadth find the length and breadth look at here suppose the given rectangle here 4 cm longer than its width length is four, uh, width is x cm x cm length is x plus 4 area equal to length and breadth x plus 4 into x which is equal 26 so multiply x squared plus 4x minus 26 equal to 0 here Yeah, 26 minus 26 equal then this is a quadratic by solving this x equal to minus b plus minus root b square 16 minus 4 a is 1 plus minus 26 by 2a therefore x equal minus 4 plus or minus root of 16 plus minus minus plus or 6 are 24 2 carries 4 2s are 8 104 by 2 therefore x equal minus 4 plus or minus 1 20 by 2 therefore x equal minus 4 plus or minus 120 can be split as 2 is 60 2 is 30 2 is 15 and 3 is 5 and y is 1 which is equal to root of 30 to root of 30 over 2 which is equal x equal minus 4 plus or minus here take 2 out minus 2 plus or minus root of 30 because 2 common by 2 but this one so we have x equal positive take root of 30 plus 2 and that is this is a width length is therefore width equal root of 30 plus 2 length equal of 30 minus 2. Suppose area we check. Area equal to length into breadth root of 30 into 2 root of 30 minus 2 equal 30 minus 4. 26 we got. So area equal 26 we checked. So length is root 30 with this with this 
Therefore, length is length width is x width is x length is six here. Your mistake. Here, x take it positive. That is root thirty minus two. This is a width. Therefore, length this is a width. Length is length is x plus four, which is equal to root thirty plus two. Therefore, width is root thirty minus two. Length is root thirty plus two. We can check area. Length into breadth root thirty minus two. Root thirty plus two equal thirty minus four equal twenty six. We checked. So so far we discussed about a simple problem regarding quadratics. We have done. Please subscribe our YouTube channel.